I now give the floor to the International Service for Human Rights. More than 1,200 people were killed in Al-Ganina in West Darfur by Janjaweed militias and RSF, according to civilians who fled the city. The attacks targeted civilians from one ethnic group in an alarming pattern that amounts to ethnic cleansing. Women and children are the most affected by the conflict, with hundreds of thousands trapped without protection nor support. Women in other areas, such as North and South Darfur, North Kordofan and Khartoum, continue to suffer from the continuous fighting since April 15. Sexual and gender-based violence was used as a weapon in this conflict. In the city of Al-Abyad in North Kordofan has been under siege by the RSF for weeks. Civilians are trapped without access to health care nor humanitarian aid. The ongoing war has led to the displacement of over 2 million people, with women and children most affected. More than 300,000 crossed the borders to neighboring countries. Women and girls are suffering in the process of displacement with increasing insecurity on the roads, lack of food, health care, risks of sexual violence, and visa requirements for Sudanese refugees hinder their ability to escape to safer places within and outside Sudan. We demand both parties in the conflict to halt hostilities, protect civilians, including women from sexual violence, open humanitarian corridors within Sudan and towards borders under the supervision of international humanitarian organizations, and guarantee the provision of essential services, including for um, survivors, to support women defenders in the country or fleeing prosecution, including through the effective, meaningful, and genuine participation of women defenders, activists, and peace builders in peace processes in line with Security Council Resolution 1325, and on the Human Rights Council to establish an international investigative mechanism. Thank you. Thank you.